Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. This is Eileen with Unique Gifts and Decor by Lady Di. Happy Saturday. I'm hoping everybody's having a wonderful day. You're out relaxing, you're running your errands, whatever you're doing, I'm hoping you are enjoying your day. Well, as you can see, I've been busy. I've been working on some baskets. Um, been trying to get these concepts together, but I think I finally got it. Haven't got them wrapped yet, but I will do that in a video shortly. But I just want to show you what I've come up with. Now, I've got these buckets, and you probably saw previously in a haul that I did, but I was trying to figure out what I was going to do with these buckets. So on this first one, it's a basically a, hit, a Mr. and Mrs. basket. It's a red and um, black throw that I have put in the basket. I have this white spa pillow here as well. I have two wine glasses here, and I have a bottle of sparkling cider here, as well as a candle, and I put a red and um, gold ribbon around it. I have some perfume, it's the Wicked for the lady, and I also have some fire and spice um, cologne, as well as the body lotion for the man. So this is just a little basket for him and her. They can just relax, enjoy the rest of the evening, uh, sitting by the fire with the candle going, or just sitting around and just enjoying each other's company. My next basket here is, um, it looks like it's a Halloween thing, but it wasn't supposed to be like that, but it is what it is. But anyway, these are some of the um, soup bowls that I had got previously from uh, one of the, my vendors. And it has those timers on there. And I thought they were very cute. It says home is where the heart is. So they are very, very classy looking. Also, I've got some hand soap in here. You can always need hand soap in your kitchen. As well as this little container with the little wooden spoon. Now you can put um, anything in those containers. Um, this also has a candle. It's the True Living Essentials Market Citrus Candle that blends in with the decor. I also have a wooden spoon and a spatula as well. Have this little floor arrangement here. As you can see, it has um, two colors on there. I do also have some, um, they're called flower sacks. And they, they are two of them that are attached to a chalkboard on the back. And um, they work great with the decor here. So this is one of my baskets that I did complete as well with the bucket. Also, this next basket is another one that I completed. It looks like it's the neutral theme that I'm going with this one. Now, this tote that I got about, uh, maybe about a couple of weeks ago, maybe a week ago, and it's um, black with the tan on it as well. It has the straps, which is very sturdy. Now, I also put in this basket a dish towel, which is um, the tan and white theme. I have this cozy, comfy, cozy candle. It says Sunday Fog, and it smells good. I wrapped a tan and gold uh, ribbon around it to make it look a little classy. Also, I have this um, vase. It's the white and tan vase. I've got some utensils inside there as well. And coming back down here, I've got the tan washcloth. I do have the brown hand soap, which coordinates with everything. I've got these cozy, um, they're cottage, co cozy cottage, excuse me, uh, soup bowls. And I added two to the basket. I've got this little flower um, vase here, and the decor matches very good with the basket. Back here is a picture frame, but it's a picture, and then it has, you can, in where the uh, flower is, you can put a picture there. So I thought that would match perfectly with the decor. And I have this large cutting board, and I think it says, hello, fall. So it goes with the season, but it can go with any season, okay? I've got this throw here, and it's a tan and white throw. So it worked perfectly with this basket. So I am loving this basket. What y'all think? Did I do it or did I not do it? <laughs> okay, so we're going around the my um island island here. Now this is a soup cozy soup basket. 
So I have a lot of these cozy soup bowls and I thought I would just do a soup basket. So the tray, uh, the basket I got the other day, I think I got it at Dollar General, but I've seen them in Walmart, I've seen them in Target. So if you were looking for this concept, you can just find any basket, but this has the liner with it, which I thought it worked well with the green. I got a green dishcloth that I put in here, as well as got some instant bouillon cubes. I've got two of these. As well, I've got a soup rest, which says, give it a rest. And this book that I found, is, it says, chicken soup for the entrepreneur's soul. So that's like a little book. If someone is sick, um, they've got a book to read. They've got some soup. they got some crackers. And they won't have to worry about getting anything up. Once you get your soup, you sit in the bed, eat your soup, relax, and just read a little bit. Got some garden vegetable crackers here. As well as I've got um, I've got this little flower again in the vase, and which matches perfectly with my decor. And I've got some chicken soup mixed back here, chicken noodle soup mixed back here. So this is just a little basket that I have put together. Um, I thought I could start using something with, make something with these cozy um, soup bowls. But that's that basket. Now we're going to the other one. So it's also the basket as well, but this has a blue liner, as you can see. The other one was a green liner. So what I did, I just made it kind of like a coffee lover's basket. So I've got a little blue and white sign with the wooden frame. I've got some coffee. I've got the Jim Bean original coffee here, and I've got the Harry and David, the golden blend coffee there as well. And I'm gonna have to straighten that up before I um, wrap it up. I also got the little uh, container with the little, the canister with the little wooden spoon. I've got these coffee mugs. It says, what is done in love is done well. Makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? So I'm going to put that back in there. And I got these little beads, kind of little decor that I have attached to the um, coffee uh, mug. And I topped it off with these Danish butter cookies. And then I also have a dishcloth, which is the uh, blue and white theme here. So this is a coffee lover's basket. Last but not least, you guys, this is, I don't know if this is my favorite or the other one. Let me go back over here. <laughs> or this is my favorite. You all tell me. So I've been looking at this tote. And I saw it in Dollar General, and it's for the fall, and they have so many different sizes. But I thought I wanted to do something special. So what I did, as you can see, is design a basket with this beautiful tote. I love the tote. So let me tell you what's all in here. So I've got the big cutting board on the back, and I've got some two large blue bath towels. I've got this candle, salt, air, and scent. Can oh, excuse me, salt, air, and sand scented candle. And I saw this wreath, which has the blue and the green. And I thought that matched perfectly with this basket. The basket does have the blue, and it has some green in there with the orange and the white. But I think that matched perfectly. Now, also, I have these mugs, I mean, these uh, soup mugs again, and I, they, the lettering on there matches great with the tote, so I've got two of those, and I also have wooden spoon and a spatula here, as well as one of those other vases, so I think it turned out you guys real well, um, and I got, topped it off with these roses that I got from uh, Timu. There is the royal blue one and there is the white one. So these are my baskets that I have been working with today. And I do have some other ones to show you, but this is, I'm just gonna show you what I've been working on and I will go over these later on with you to let you see that what I have been working on and I'll go into detail a little later. Also, here's some more over here as well that I am trying to work on and get, get assembled. 
But I also want to show you something else that I have got. I've got these trays. Um, I think I got them last year when the clearance sale after Christmas. So I'm thinking about finding something to do with these trays. Um, I haven't decided yet, but you know your girl going to come up with something special. But anyway, I do thank you all for watching my videos. Please like and share. Let me know what you think about my baskets. How did I do? Did I do okay or should i have done something different you all tell me but i think i did okay but you know <laughs> i just think this is something that other people would like that's why i do my baskets i, I fix them where something that i would really like to receive which i know if i like to receive it i'm pretty sure somebody else would too but again thank you so much for liking sharing enjoy your day until the next video goodbye